you have an eye disease or an eye problem and your doctor suggested corneal transplants. Well, I want you to first understand that corneal transplants aren't what they used to be. They used to be terrible uh, and they were very invasive. You know, they were good for those that had advanced diseases, but the transplants themselves were very crude and somewhat rudimentary. And as times passed, the surgeons have actually improved those, those techniques tremendously. Um, they've been able to do a lot of things to be able to make sure that not only can we maintain or manage the eye disease that caused the eye problem or the trauma that caused the cornea to go bad, but there's actually some really slick eye, disease, uh, eye, uh, eye surgeries they've done lately. And a lot of them have to do with lasers. Um, when they go in with the lasers, they can actually precisely cut out a cornea exactly what they need. They can cut out parts of it, the front half, the back half, whatever they need. And in many cases, it's not very, and it's not intrusive at all to the eye. Now, it's still a transplant. You're thinking, well, don't you have to take medication after that for you know, any rejection? It's not the same thing. In fact, cornea transplants, that's done significantly more than all other transplants. It's not something that we need to worry about as much the rejection because there's not any blood vessels in the tissue. Because there's no blood vessels, your body doesn't necessarily respond to it as being some foreign object. So you can dispel some of that concern. Um, but yeah, it's still a surgery. You've already dealt with a lot with your eyes because of keratoconus or because of other corneal dystrophies or trauma. It's not necessarily the worst thing to get the corneal transplant at this point. They can actually improve your vision significantly in combination with different laser techniques and laser surgeries, we may be able to even improve your vision much more than what you've had in a long time. Contact lenses are a great option to help delay some corneal transplants, and specialty contact lenses are always a good option. Most surgeons will ask you to, to go that route as much as possible. But if you ever do have to get a corneal transplant, don't worry as much. Make sure you do your background on what kind of surgery you're getting, why, and make sure you see what kind of techniques the surgeon's done. Those things have made a big difference because not all surgeons are going to be doing the latest and greatest surgeries. You know, make sure that they are good and they are doing exactly what you need to give you the best result. When next time you need to talk to your doctor about corneal transplants, ask him what, what it can do and what, what it can offer to help improve your vision. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn more about you know, the different surgical techniques or things you can do to help take care of your eyes, you know, like us on Facebook, like us on Google+, and subscribe to us on YouTube to learn more and keep up to date with your eyes.